the Business Factories North Tyneside Council's business startup service for residents of North Tyneside. The purpose is to um, is to support and encourage enterprise across across the borough of North Tyneside to um, enable residents to achieve um, their expectations to um, increase personal satisfaction in their, their lifestyle and well-being. We uh, we also aim to um, introduce self-employment to as many residents as possible, aging from age 16 to you know. Well, there is no age limit on the business factory services. To date, we have set up over 850 businesses since January 2012, which is just phenomenal. And one new business starts every day in North Tyneside. Good morning, the Business Factory. Can I help you? Very frequently, we have an introduction to self-employment, which covers all aspects of what people would like to know to start working for themselves. We have more general courses such as marketing and sales, which deals with how to find and keep customers. We have social media specialist workshops on how to deal with Facebook for business, for instance, because it's a very different matter dealing with it for business than it is for social purposes. We run an eBay workshop, how to sell on eBay, I do that one. And we have bookkeeping, record keeping workshops. There's a wide variety. Objective-wise, give you as much as I possibly can. Not only does it give them the, the back end of knowing that their idea has been fully um, explored in every sense of the word, looking at the business plan, uh, market research stage, right the way through uh, to to start up and, and looking at the cash flows, etc. But I think more often than not, it's about giving people the encouragement and empowering them to be able to look at the idea and know they can take it forward for themselves. So, uh, more, more almost like a coach as well as a business advisor and and, and letting them take accountability for themselves to be able to move it forward. I wanted to move back into design and I have left my full-time job and I'm now working with the business factory only two months into my business. It's very scary but I am getting a lot of support from the business factory. Being able to just bounce it off somebody over a cup of tea for 10 minutes is a lot more useful than going hours and hours on Google going well, what about this and what about that and coming to assumptions that may be not wrong but not exactly 100% right where you can sit down with somebody who's had experience and gone through that process and knows the ins and outs and every step you have to take, it's invaluable. But I think everyone who comes in here goes away with more information than when they arrive. We'd went to see somebody else who was uh, like a business advisor mm. and um, he was quite negative about it, saying, oh, you know, it's the wrong time, it's quite a bad time with the recession. We left that meeting thinking, oh, same thing, you need the confidence, don't you? When I came to the business factory, my advisor, who was Ross, was so enthusiastic about it and just made you feel like it was possible. We've got people with different skill sets who have had an awful lot of help from this business factory. I know I would be very happy to come and deliver some training for free to people who needed it just as a thank you and a payback for the help that I've been given. What we're aiming to do is to provide support to all kinds of businesses Within town centres, they're typically retail businesses, um, and that's where my role comes in. Um, and we offer a range of support services there, particularly for those looking to start up in retail for the first time. We've talked about how the business factory helps people to follow their dream, um, and it's many people's dream to own a shop. But the reality is that it's a dream that can very easily go sour um, if you don't have the right advice and the right support and our role is really to help people realise that dream and make sure it becomes a dream and not a nightmare. The business that I've got now started is a hobby um, and I just think as it kind of grew it was time to let go of the job that I really disliked and do what I wanted to do and to be quite honest I think the business factory just really gave me the confidence to do that.